Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are working on day three and four in my October daily. So I created uh, these six by eight photos on Canva and I decided to sandwich in between the two pages um, this uh, protector sheet with the two by twos on there. So there's uh, 12 of them, I believe. So on one side, um, I have all the kid friendly and that clear pocket in the middle I put some sequins and I'm putting this 3d sticker on for like a film and then on the back I am going to make room to add another 3d sticker uh, these stickers are actually from the Dollar Tree and um, I was just trying to decide which one goes best I add a little bit more foam adhesive on the back of them just to kind of make sure they stay on <laughs> but um, I'm going to go ahead and try to cover up what is on the front of it so it's not too noticeable. And there we have our shaker pocket. So that one is done. Um, here, um, like I said, I created this in Canva. So um, it was like a birthday invite or something. And I just kind of reworded it, changed the colors to match the colors that I wanted. Um, I cut it a 6.75 by 8.25, I believe. So it could be the out of the pocket size. And then I'm going to look at this Hey Pumpkin chipboard sticker um, set to see what else I can add to it. I believe I add this cat, but I'm going to make like a little uh, banner, fishtail banner thing <laughs> um, with some scrap that I have. Uh, I think it was a um, from like the paper pad cannot think of what you call them but like at the very top where you tear off your paper um but yeah I kind of fishtailed it a little bit and then I'm going to adhere it down first so then I could put the cat on top of it so I can have it where I want it to be and I just love these bright colors because I thought it looked super fun since this was part of the like kid-friendly non-spooky movies so there's that page and then the second one same thing this was another birthday invite uh, or a party invite and I just kind of it said um chills and thrills but I went ahead and adjusted it to put um I think it says fave spooky movies and then watch at your own risk so I'm gonna go ahead and put this down same thing the back paper is 6.75 by uh 8.25 and then I'm <laughs> one-handed I wanted to add this like label kind of on the side so it kind of worked like a tab, but um, I eventually will go back and put something on there. Just not too sure. Um, but yeah, so this is how it will look. Um, oh, hold on. I forgot. I'm going to add the <laughs> chipboard stars on it um, on the left side. And then on the right side, I'm going to add, hopefully it's in frame, but I'm going to add this bat to the top. I wanted to put it... Um, on that right corner but I'll actually put it on that left corner there and then this is how it'll look when you flip perfect and then I'm actually gonna work this is just like a bonus page I made like a October daily um, I, I guess that would be like a mood board type of thing but it has um I put the pictures that I wanted uh, in this collage here and then at the very top I added the colors that you know would go with my color scheme and then at the bottom it says October daily and I'm just gonna go ahead um I use this I have these this super old glitter paper or cardstock so I already had circles punched out so I'm gonna use one on one side and then on the back side of it I'm gonna put the other one to um so it works like a tab as well Then I'm going to punch out my holes to make sure when I do the back side of it that I am not covering up any holes because I have done that before. Um, I'm going to add this little chipboard girl from the Hey Pumpkin line again and a little Halloween witch hat on the top. And then here I am. I'm going to adhere the back part of that circle glitter tab that I'm going to create right there. And then this one here <laughs> also... Um, I changed the colors to what I wanted and it just says, you can't scare me. I'm a mom. 
And I thought that was like a super cute filler page since, you know, it was cute. And I, I obviously didn't have like a specific day to put this on. So I just thought, oh, that'd be a cute filler page. But I'm going to go ahead and put this chipboard, go through these clear stickers here that I have and add a few bats uh, flying out of that bottom chipboard that says eek. And I believe I call this one done. I think it's super cute, super simple. Love it. So here's a flip through. Um, once I place these in where they need to be, um, I am going to give you a flip of all the pages here so far. And then here I'm going to add the pages we just worked on right now. Thank you again for watching and I'll be seeing you guys soon. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.